Hold up. You're wasting your time. He's not in. Gotcha. So that's him. He's got a gun. Is that a problem? Well, problems are why you keep me around, right? Time him. I'm curious. Too late. He's in. Already? Don't say I don't know. I have no idea. Nuh uh. No synonyms either. Give me a real answer. I'm just not that into aliens or video games. It's not just any alien. It's. Oh, come on. Anyone else having a problem with their phone? Ooh, what? Oh, God. Oh, God. Raised in Oakland, but was born in. <laughs> His deal is, he's been hanging around the DedSec IRC, and he's got cred. Figured we'd give him a test drive. On the hardest difficulty, nobody's been able to delete their CTOS profile before. I want to see if he's smart, stubborn, or both. Get yourself up. Suspects and brains do a full sweep on it. 
CTOS tagged him as the prime suspect in a high-tech burglary, so... He's done time? Community service. Not enough evidence. Just the word of CTOS's predictive algorithms. But once in the system... Always in the system. Holy shit! <laughs> he went for it! You won't have much time before the backups kick in. Going in the hot aisle. It's at least 120 degrees in there. <laughs> the man props. He's going the mile. Nobody's gotten that far. This is like the secret cow level. I think he got through. Let's close it up here.
Why is my threat so high? This is bullshit. Or, I could just... gonna drop a little back door into the system so I can get back inside later. Sorry, Bloom. We've got unfinished business. He's heading out. Bag him. Yeah. There. Help him. Where the fuck am I going? Josh. Okay. Okay. Fuck you, Bloom. In 2013, Chicago realized the promise of smart cities with CTOS, a citywide operating system merging big data with surveillance, security, and transit programs. With a few hundred lines of code, hackers were able to hijack its central servers and cripple the entire grid. Many believed the attack would be a killing blow for smart city development. They were wrong. 
Coordinated from the heart of Silicon Valley, CTOS 2.0 has been implemented across the United States, ushering in the Internet of Things. 6.4 billion connected devices now serve as collection points, mapping and recording our daily routines, making a more secure and more invasive system. But who else is listening? Big Brother no longer works alone. Thousands of little brothers monitor and aggregate your every move, building a complete digital profile of you to be bought, sold, or stolen in an instant. Toys study your children, reporting their play habits back to marketers. Appliances, consoles, and home security systems give corporations a window into your private life. Control of your vehicle and mobile device can now be breached remotely by anyone at any time. You may think that you are immune or underestimate the risk, but your digital shadow is already compromised. Insurance companies use algorithms to monitor your life habits and limit or deny coverage. Health providers determine if your cancer is is worth treating. Search results and news fees are skewed to bias mood and influence your vote, engineering social uprisings on a massive scale. You are now less valuable than the data you produce. Data you produce. This is the new reality. Going dark is no longer an option. With threats to personal freedom rising, many are stepping forward. Whistleblowers, activists, and hackers have drawn their battle lines, putting the establishment on watch. But are they threats themselves, or have they become freedom's last line of defense? Freedom's last line of defense. So, am I in? Welcome to Dead Sec. I'm Satara. This sweetheart is Josh, AKA Hot Sauce. Yo, your hot sauce? Yo, man, I loved your frat house hat. Real talk. Thanks. This weirdo's wrench. The needs of the many. And this Casanova is Horatio. What's up, brother? Mm -hmm. It's the crew, huh? Took y'all long enough to come get me. Shit. You saw Bloom's bullshit. CTOS isn't just regulating infrastructure. The amount of personal data that thing is collecting is fucking mind-blowing. Yeah. It's Big Brother and Little Brother all rolled up into one. Huh? Sees everything you do and tells on you. Thank you, Josh. So what's the fix? Sledgehammers and fire. No! Sledgehammers on fire. <laughs> All of that data in one place means they can reject your fucking application before you click on it. <laughs> Congratulations, you have been pre-rejected for our credit card. Or your house, or your insurance. That's not even the worst case scenario. All that data in the hands of the government? They'll arrest you for shit before you even do it. Yeah, I've been there. Now I fucking know why. Man, f fuck it! Fuck it, man. We're hackers. We, we out think, we out dare. I, I say we tear down the fucking wall. Hey, show everyone what, what Bloom's up to, man. Show, show the world that their personal data is being used to rob them of their fucking freedoms. Fuck. I installed a back door, so all we gotta do is walk right through. Uh, hold on. What? He installed the back door, so all we have to do is walk through. Bingo. Hey, man. Do you got the time? Oh, yeah, man. I... I got it. I got it. It's kind of late for a night run, isn't it? Hey, what, are you, what are you running from the cops? <laughs> Maybe I am one. Hey, hey you, you look familiar. <laughs> Have a good party. Fuck. 
king. This motherfucker. Fuck you, Bloom. I'm gonna go have a goddamn good time. Hello? Whose phone is this? It's your new phone. Where's my phone? In the ocean, where you threw it, I think. I don't remember. I was pretty smashed. Look, meet us at the hackerspace. Where? Check your pics and figure it out. Place am I in? Cause I could never make you happy. No, I'm not too bad. Only when I get left, makes it so very hard to go. Guess I was lit, huh? <laughs> like Mardi Gras. Go get yourself something to wear, and I'll tell you where to go next. Oh, and you'll need your phone ready for operations. So hit the store and download your apps before you get here. Damn, walk of shame on my first day.
All right, Sitar. So where you at? Sending you the location and the passcode for the door. So Josh and I spoke, and fucking over Bloom has been a long-standing project. All right, you need two things to take down Bloom. You need to get people to rally behind your cause to separate you from the trolls. And we need bots, and a lot of them to handle the data CTUS is processing. Thank you, Josh. We spent all night modifying our app so you can get followers to download the app, and we can use their processing power for the cause. This is happening? It's really happening? Mm -hmm. yeah, man, this is happening. You better get to it. <laughs> Hell yeah, man! Barbarians are at the gate, ready to bust some Roman heads. Yeah, we're gonna focus on some high-profile ops, playing for exposure and laughs to get people to download our app. Mm -hmm. All right. Don't worry. So that was something fun. <laughs> Marcus! Haha, <laughs> check you out! Alive and dry. I wasn't sure after your moonlight swim. Come here, you've gotta check this out. Behold! Our very own open source research app. So, like, all of us here pool vulnerabilities that we find, and we encourage everyone to share their work, their research, etc. Okay, so what's the research app do? Widen our skill set? Make us irresistible to the gender of our choice? What, so it's like a I know kung fu kind of deal? If kung fu was a gender and not so 1999, absolutely. <laughs>
Behold, the wonders of technology. A 3D printer. This is the army of printers. It is capable of pumping out an arsenal of lethal weapons down. Seriously? Yep. Once you master it, voila! Hipster merchant of death. All good, except I'm no hipster. <laughs> you keep telling yourself that. Now try to make something. But don't blow us up. She can't hear her own thoughts. Told my old ho, she my new. Told my new, she my old ho. But she used to be your dead. Hold up, flatline. I sleep, nap time. Put my name on it, that's mine. Chris so when she thought I got baptized. Asking where I'm at, that's set up. You ain't talking about nothing, shut up. If you got a side chick, what up? Both my girls in the club, about to up. Stalking on my network, got it looking so hard that a neck hurt. And I ain't tripping, I got room for them both. This is Ham Squad, I just double it on my network. Sit on the mic, sit the club, and I know they know about each other. Oh yeah, I think these things trying to set me up. Maybe I'm just paranoid. I'm paranoid, I'm trippin', I've been smoking and sippin', I'm fucking around with two kids, but I never made them my missus, yeah, I'm paranoid, I'm trippin', I've been smoking and sippin', I'm fucking around with two kids, but I never made them my missus, no, I'm sitting to them, I'm in the club, and I know they know about each other. Good to have another brother here. Good to be here, man. Are you all hackers? Yeah, kind of a basic requirement to get invited into the hacker space. But we all have our specialties, like Josh over there. Always building shit that shouldn't work. Now he's trying to build this big-ass drone. And wrench? Good engineer, too. But better at breaking shit apart. And yo, Satara? <laughs> Sis got skills as an artist and a graphic designer. Without her, dead sex walking around without a face or voice. What about you? What's your superpower? Tactical coordinator or cat herder. Take your pick. I make dead sec go where it has the most impact. You heard of Prime 8? Those are some real dirty hacking motherfuckers. Yeah, I've brushed up against them before. It wasn't pleasant. All right, that's what I like to hear. Link up with me when you're ready to do this, and I'll fill you in. There's always someone running ops against Prime 8. Bet they'd love your help. It's something, right? This whole place is something. We used to keep track of news feeds on here, but now it's our follower wall. So it knows if we're trending? No, no, no. It's based on hard values. How many people downloaded our app, how much processing power we have access to, you know. <laughs> nice. And speaking of which, we're downloading the DeadSec app into your phone as we speak. When it's ready, open it up, click the suggested op, and hit the park outside so we can test it. Sounds good. One more thing. 
I put a reminder on your phone so you remember what we're gunning for. Get enough processing power to take down Bloom. Coming up after the break, we'll be sitting down with a former street artist. Sweet T, as he's known in the community, is here to promote a new book of his art and a brand new fashion line, including t-shirts, caps, and bling. Very exciting stuff. App's downloaded and I'm in the park. What am I testing? Start profiling things around you. People, devices. See what you can pull from them. That's what helps us figure out our next ops. And running ops that are important to people is how we get them interested in DedSec. The more followers download our app, the more intel we get. It's the circle of life. Oh, and see if you can find some components to help us with our research. Keeps the merchant. <sighs> the app is your data mining tool. Of death. Okay, okay, I got this. So what now? Up to you, man. You're free to do whatever catches your eye. We post ops to the DeadSec app, and doing them helps us get followers. And followers are our Skrilla. Followers mean computers, which boosts our processing power, which lets us do bigger and better ops. Yeah. Yo, 
Hey, so what's this about Bobo Dakes? You know Bobo's working on a new album, right? Yeah, I heard. Well, you won't get to hear it? Motherfucker Gene Carcaney just put millions on the table to keep it all to himself. What does a big pharma CEO want with a rap album? Dude has a huge Bobo collection. And he probably wants to hang that shit on his wall like a damn trophy. Just rubbing his money in our faces, bruh. Do you know if Bobo took the deal? He hasn't announced anything yet, but he will. It's a lot of cash. Man, maybe there's still time for an intervention. Time for what? I assume you guys have heard of Gene Carcani? He's the shit sack who's on TV laughing about how he's raising the price of leukemia medicine. Yeah, the most hated man in America? Yeah, why ask? Guy's a huge Bobo Dakes fan. Must have read Bobo's in town recording new tracks because he's offering millions to keep the album to himself. So stupid. Bobo will never go for it. The real one won't. So we're gonna do it for him. I'm gonna visit Bobo and see if I can borrow some of his new tracks as proof that we're legit. How do we contact Karkani? I need you guys to run through interviews, podcasts, whatever. Find me some usable lines. We're gonna make a soundboard. Ooh, I love this. Sweet. Hey, don't watch it without me. <laughs> Meet you at the hacker space. I'm on my way. organization New Dawn is accusing Oakland City Councilor Miranda Kamei of defamation. In a recent interview, the councilor had described the organization as, quote, a fraudulent pyramid scheme. The organization seems to have fought back with more than just lawyers. The councilor's private life was recently revealed when medical records of the councilor's transgender treatments were mysteriously released to the media. A spokesperson for New Dawn said that the organization had nothing to do with the leaked medical records and in her statement accused Councillor Kamei of desperately seeking attention. I've got
got a new Bobo track the world has never heard before. How's the soundboard coming? Yo, a Bobo takes, bitch. <laughs> oh, perfect. So, how do we contact Karkani? I'm gonna visit his mansion. I need to see his face when we do this. Time to mess with the farmer clown. This ass face deserves it. Hello? Sup? Uh, sup? Who is this? Holy shit. I'm a huge fan. Are you taking me up on my offer? Yeah, I laid down some hot tracks. Really? Fantastic. Yup. Can I get a sample? Born and raised, born and crazy. Hands are blown the fuck away. Real and funky. He ain't the hero of the story. Don't go out in a blaze of glory. Make my day. Tell a Bobo sent you. Damn, that's dope. That's your best work yet. You're welcome. And this is exclusive, right? No one else gets this, just me? Yup. So how do you want payment? The bitch better have my money. I do. I just need to know how to route it to you. Y'all, check it. Ah, there. That's the routing number? Yup. Uh-huh. Sent and confirmed. You got it. This is awesome, man. This is like a dream come true. Yo, bitch, it's Bobo Dakes. What? They say God made man in his own image, but God made himself in Bobo's image. What are you talking about? Yo, bitch, it's Bobo Dakes. No. 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 No, 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 no. Bobo King, bitches. Fuck you. Fuck you, who the fuck are you? Yo, bitch, it's Bobo Dakes. Fuck off, fucker! Tell me who the fuck you are! You are dead! You are dead, you know that? You are so dead! 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 You fuck! You fuck! You fuck! Guys, guys, he just, he just donated 20 million to leukemia research. <laughs> Bitch better have my money. <laughs> Yo, who did that?
Something's there. Congrats, Marcus. Our follower count is growing fast. How many are actually giving us access to their computers? All of them. That's the point. They give us access to their power. We grow a network of computers that makes us stronger. Our own giant cloud computing network. So do people sign a contract? I vow to let DedSec own my processor? We're transparent. They know before they ever install the app that they're giving us access to their computing power. But never their personal info. That's a lot of trust. Silicon Valley would kill to have that level of intrusion. Private data farming runs their whole economy. Yeah, but we look out for our own, man. That's why people are joining our movement. To make a statement against the technocrats. Marcus, have you seen the trailer for the new Jimmy Siska movie? No, it's out. Hey, hey pull it up, no, man. No, no, not on this. 
For this, we need perfect sound. We need a big screen. We need to be comfy. You're right. We need quiet. Have you seen it yet? No, man. I waited for you. You're the best. Thank you. All right, everybody, we're going to watch the trailer. Shut the fuck up. Shut up. In a world where technology connects everything. I'm not looking for justice, goddammit. One man prowls the information superhighway in search of cyber justice. I'm looking for cyber justice. Simple line of code could devastate the whole world. It's gonna be a cyber caster. Cyber Driver. Hit him with the code for a chip. Jimmy Siska is... Ah! Got no choice, kiddies. Follow me, or die. Devon Von Devon. We gotta get these hackers somewhere safe. They aren't hackers, Devon. They're just script kiddies. Hey, the car answered. This ain't your mama's smart car. I think next time we're gonna need a higher firewall, pal. Cyber, Cyber Driver. <laughs> Action hero, badass. Talking car. Admit it, Josh. The car is cool. You know what I'm thinking? We cut our own version of that trailer. And that car is gonna help us do it. For real? Wouldn't have us a ton of followers. Yo, first, Josh and I will go to the studio to get that script. We'll look around and see what other gems they have about death sec. And we'll look for the car. All right, so what's the deal here? Are we, are we issuing an advisory? No, why would we do that? They'll just patch the holes. No, uh, let them. Don't worry, cyber child. Oh, don't. Hacker movie's gonna get hacked. HMP Studios, we are holding you solely responsible for the threat that is Cyber Driver. Cyber Driver. Cheesy stunts and bad dialogue, we can take. But you've insulted our intelligence, and that we can't excuse. It seems like you could deal with a lesson on what hackers are capable of. And since you didn't come to us to learn, we'll come to you to teach. We are launching Operation Hacking Run. We'll show you what hackers can do. We are dead set. You guys thought that movie was gonna be good? <laughs> well, yeah, sure. They're fun to laugh at. Cool, you said. Uh, did I actually say cool? Here's what we know, Josh. Cyber Driver is shaped up to be a million dollar cyber catastrophe. I know you're trying to get my goats with that word. Uh, I don't want that, man. Keep your goats. Why would Galilei allow their name to be sullied? You mean cyberized? You can keep trying, but it will never be funny to me. I'm not gonna lie. If those scenes were what they chose for the trailer, yeah, the rest of it's gonna be jack shit. And why they chose to target DedSec is curious. Well, Chicago was a big deal. True. Anyway, don't worry. You and me are prowling the information highway to seek out our own cyber justice. Look, Josh, we're gonna have fun with this. And I promise I won't say cyber anymore. You know, after this, the cyber world will never be the same. <laughs> And there it is, Hook Motion Picture Studios.
Okay, guys, I'm in. that Found it. We got the full scripted cyber driver.
Here we go. Found the emails. Mmm, nice. The not-so-secret emails. Well, seems I got everything. What about the car? It isn't here. We'll have to track it down some other way. I'm heading out now. Hey guys, I found an email that says the car is being delivered to a location, but doesn't say where or when. That's okay. I think I have a backup plan. Sent this crap to me. I don't even want to waste my time on this. Marcus, I have a paparazzi contact who knows where the car is. He's waiting for you. We'll give him whatever he asks for out of that email dump. He's good for it. Sure. You have a pop. stealing some primate intel? You got something for me? One of their lackeys in your neck of the woods. Hack them for what they've got, but make sure you don't get caught. You know how primate do? What do we got?
Hey, hey. You're lost. Get out of the car. If you want deets on where the car is at, better have something juicy for me. Like Jimmy Siska and pop star Nelly Shire? They are banging. I knew it. See, okay, now we're talking. Consider it sent. <laughs> Hella cool. Coolosity. All right. I sent you the GPS of the car's route. Something over there.
Powering up. System check. Sweet! Let's roll. All units, we are in pursuit of a stolen vehicle from the movie studio. All units, air support requested. Squad, we have reports of a hostile in your area. Do you feel the need? The need for speed. Well, I'm authorizing myself, motherfucker. Wrench, you hear this? The car is talking. All units, suspect is still in the area. Let's find. Suspect is still in the area. Let's find. Your face is too dark for my sensors to read. What? Bitch, I'm black and I'm proud. Tell your sensors to calibrate that. I have no weapons for black. No, of course you don't. feet inside the tornado at all times. Hang on to your innards, Devin. Together, we will carve up the streets. Wait, did you just say a line from the movie? Wrench, you hearing this? I am one nitrous jacked smart car. Point to check towards the east. Oh, wait, did, did you just say the car quoted the movie? Yeah. The car has been dispatched after the suspect. That is so meta! I'm clear. Meet you at the garage. On my way. I am Devin Von Devin and I am... You are not Devin. Devin Von Devin is handsome and swarthy. <laughs> you are not. Oh, uh, come on. I'm sure as hell swarthier than any dude named Von Devin. Oh, man, this card. This car is something else. Yeah, well, kudos to Galilee for getting the studio to pay for this lemon. Lemon? Did you hear it? And never mind voice recognition. I mean, sure, it needs a smack of sided scripting, but it had cogent responses. Do you know how much work had to go into that? Uh, Galilei has been talking about machine learning for their Mars probe, but, man, I didn't expect it to be as advanced as it... What? Oh, man. Oh, I know it! <laughs> I do not approve of you driving me, Marcus. You're not as swarthy as Devin Von Devon. I knew it had too much smart ass to be smart. Wow. Shiny and new. So it wasn't responding at all? Well, does, um... Does, does that count? Yeah, fuck you, man. Fuck you. <laughs> the car's designed for autonomous control, but nothing's there or even calibrated. It's capable, but suboptimal. Not junk. See? That's what I'm talking about. Think positive. It's just stupid. So that's the plan? Fix a smart car the space company couldn't? Problem? No, we got this. One, one, please. 
state your emergency. We need the police! This man's firing at people! Remain calm. Police are now in transit. 911, please state the nature of your emergency. 911? Oh shit! There's a shooter! Help! TOS has verified your location. Police are on the way. I can't be right. You got the map. I take care of your taxes, remember? You better hope I didn't get the map. Hey, what's the hang on? I'm calling it.
suspect.
control SUV has been dispatched after the suspect. We've lost our target. Over. He's got to be here. Doing another sweep. Over. Where's this guy hiding? Anyone see him? Score one for us. Nice. you say. Uh. <laughs> Marcus, Prime 8 got their hands on some of our data. Fuck, where are they? In a car, moving fast. And Marcus, 
They have someone on their tail. I think someone else wants what they know. Okay, I'll find something fast and get to them first. Marcus, they're getting away. You've got to move faster. Yo, I'm on it. 
My bad. No man. Nah, that's you're talking crazy. I'm in line at Quinkies and <laughs> This should come in handy. Hey, Marcus, me wrench in the garage when you're ready. Will do. Too friendly. I like you. Contest at Swelter Skelter, so I can't wait to hear what they have next time around. I. Uh. Hey! Ah. <laughs> Can you send an ambulance right away? Hackers love a challenge. Guys, let's fire it up. Oh! 
Yeah, let's do this. Started out as just a trickle, then boom. 
The numbers haven't stopped climbing. This is a good target. Yeah, but... Was it? You don't think? No, I mean, of course, look at the numbers, but... I don't know, there's... I mean, what are we gonna do? You know, for real. Aim bigger. Hell yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Are you watching? <laughs> no. It's like sadtube.com. The channel for sad people, am I right? <laughs> you ask them. Come on. Look at them. They've got their own goddamn branding. I've been following them since they accessed our server network. Jesus Christ, don't yell in my fucking ear. Use your inside voice, will ya? Anyways, it's all done other than the handshake. We're working with the human Izulu in case it gets to the collateral damage part of the relationship. They'll be discreet. Yo, come to see the magic happen? I'll let you watch while I do my thing. If you wanted magic, maybe you should be watching me work. Ho ho! Did Luke ride on Yoda's back? I think not. I was always more of a Lando man myself. Owned the Millennium Falcon, ran Cloud City, blew up the second Death Star. Killer mustache. Killer mustache. I'm more of a chewy guy myself. Rips off arms, handy with a hydro spanner, more hair than an 80s Greek porno. <laughs> I can see that. Do you want to? I still have some old tapes. Uh, I'm good. Marcus, those new Don parasites got a recruitment video killed. Can you believe it? Oh, I believe it. Jimmy Siska's greatest fits? Uh, say it ain't so. What are we gonna do about it? Come by the hackerspace when you have a minute, and we'll figure out the best way to pay them back. Hi. Right. New Dawn wants to step into the ring with us. They got our recruitment video killed on all the big social media sites and threatened to sue anyone who hosts it. This is gonna cost us a lot of followers. DMCA takedown, annoying. This is worse than annoying. This is a declaration of war. I will not be censored. Hey, New Dawn's a fucking scam. With rich people throwing away their money for some elitist circle jerk shit. This could be big for us. I mean, nobody's gonna take the side of those assholes unless they're already members. We are so gonna cornhole this fake-ass church. What's cornhole? Where the corn goes after you eat the corn, Josh. Oh. They don't like us using footage of their celebrity whore, Jimmy Siska. So let's start with him. He's our highest-profile spokesperson. But it's, it's Jimmy Siska. I mean... When I was a kid, I had the Siska glasses, the pop collar. I, I even knew every line to open wounds. Dude, me too. I even have the lunchbox. Nice. Mint condition. Nice. Just not, not Siska, okay? Just anyone but him. There's, please. there's gotta be another way, all right? I don't know. He's in town shooting Cyberdriver. 
I was just thinking maybe we could talk to him. Fuck up his relationship with New Dawn. He can go back to being less of a douchebag. Then I could go back to wearing my Cisco tees without feeling like one. Wait a minute. You use cornhole as a verb. That doesn't even make sense in the context of you. Okay, okay, we focus on Siska. <laughs> New Dawn keeps blackmail records of their celebrity shills, right? We check out the local center, we just need to get in and dig up his file. Everybody in? In. I'll round up the locals and I'll meet you there. Let the cornholing begin. <laughs> you heard the man. <laughs> Cornhole. <laughs> For too long, predators have victimized the weak and the wounded under the guise of religion. The Church of the New Dawn is a scam. Yeah. Rank in the church is based on financial contribution. Loyalty is bought through blackmail and fear. They believe they are untouchable. That will soon change. DedSec will reveal the secrets and true purpose of New Dawn. You can help. Take up a mask and protest your local recruitment center. Let their leaders know what you think of them online. Join us as we send them a message. There's no more. DedSec will give you the truth. Do what you will. Hey, Marcus. I got something to show you. Am I gonna like it? I'm gonna say 30 to 1 odds against. Then I guess I better get it out the way. See you soon. Retro, feel like stealing some primate intel? You got something? One of their lackeys in your neck of the woods. Hack them for what they've got, but make sure you don't get caught. You know how primate do.
Suspect is now on top. Weapons free. Wait, there he is! Found the suspect. studying Latin on a whim? Now that's a fucked up language. No wonder it died out. Even the Romans spoke Greek. Anyway, the first word and the last word of the sentence.
shitting me? Oops! of confidential emails has had unexpected consequences for HMP Studios. Contents of the documents expose an ongoing contentious collaboration with Galilei, the company responsible for the expensive high-tech car featured in the studio's latest blockbuster, CyberDriver. The emails reveal that a studio executive referred to the car as a useless lemon and threatened legal action against the space company. There was good news for HMP Studios, however. Following the hack, interest around the movie spiked, making CyberDriver the surprise hit of the year. Police say that the studio has yet to press charges against the hacker group. We'll keep you posted. Last time. Mm -hmm. 